How you doing, everybody? I'm back coming at you, and it's Monday. It's time for the weekly update. And um, oh man, what an insane week! We are on baby week two, I think. I don't really know, but we're slowly getting back to things, um, and which means slowly getting back to work. And tomorrow will be my first day back to my gym routine, so I'm so looking forward to that. Um, but hey, let's get into the weekly update. If you're brand new to the channel, my name is Emeka. Three things I show you how to do on this channel, how to increase your income so you can take back your freedom, so you can design that ultimate lifestyle. I do me so you can do you. And this is all about just documenting what I've been doing over the last little bit to build a passive income, an online income, a laptop lifestyle, whatever you want to call it. For me and my family, I document it so you can literally just take the blueprint of what I've been doing and do it for you and for your family or for whatever reasons you got going on. Um, so let's kind of dive into things and let's talk about it. Well, first off, let's talk. How's Kindle Publishing been going? What's been going on? Um, you know what? I'm going to give a shout out to Jacob. He came out with... Um, Elite Kindle Mastermind, I believe it's called. Oh man, sorry, sorry, bro, sorry. I should know this. Elite Kindle Mastermind. I'm just thinking about your cool intro and in your videos. And what happened was I published in a keyword, and uh, it was it was going it was going all right. And then he mentioned something um, about it and just kind of picking a specific audience and, and talking to them. And so I did that, and these books had been up for like a week, two weeks. So I already started the full process. And then I was like, oh, man, I like that. Let me see if I can, you know, do this. So what I did is I changed the keywords, adjusted the keywords, and adjusted the covers. And, you know, one week sales started picking up, second week sales started picking up, and then they've really started skyrocketing. Like last week, I'll see if I can post it up on the, the, the board here, on the board. Uh, on the screen here of uh, screenshots last week, I think we did like it was like a thousand or eleven hundred dollars just off Create Space alone from last week's sales. So that was a nice that was a nice little jump, definitely. So um, so yeah, shout out to Jacob and um, to some of the ideas, bro, you got going on in that uh, Elite Kindle Mastermind. I'm feeling them. I'm feeling them. So and what's so cool is you can see like Jacob started publishing when. Yeah, just over a year ago. Yeah, just over a year ago, probably like 13 months ago. And, um, you know, he's teaching me some things, right? So I'm always looking to learn. I'm always looking to improve myself, right? My business, because people's minds are different. And that's one thing you have to understand is you can, you can learn from anybody and everybody all the time. You just have to be open enough to listen to them, to see what they're doing, to see what they're thinking, and then say, hey, I've never thought about it like that. Or, hey, how's this person find out these things? Let me see if I can kind of think like them and, and grab some of those ideas. So, um, you know, it, it, it's not about, well, he was one of my students or anything like that. It's like, oh, man, l l look how he's thinking. How could I use that and apply it to my business? So always learning, always looking to, to improve. But things are going well on that front. Um, I got some other things working with the Kindle business that I've – I'm working on behind the scene, behind the scenes with my assistant right now. Sorry, the sun just peeped through a cloud. Um, but I'm working on some things behind the scenes. If you want, how many of you you think you're at the point in your in your business where you're ready to outsource it, or you would like um, to find out how to really outsource your business? Because one of the things that I, I do, and I haven't really talked a lot about this, but I'm going to shift more to more advanced more advanced stuff. Um, not not just like, yeah, no, it's, it's okay, more advanced stuff. I was going to say not like advanced stuff that, you know, I say for the course, because the course gives you an actual roadmap on how to do stuff and saves you time. But more advanced topics like, okay, if you're going to work with an assistant, what do you, how do you work with an assistant? So... You know, for, for the better part of 10 months, I worked maybe five hours a month in my Kindle business. And it operated around two to $3,000 a month consistently every month because my assistant was running it. He was uploading and publishing the books and taking care of everything. I did very, very, very little work. So I'm curious to see how many other people would be interested in learning what, it's, what it takes to bring on somebody to help run your business so you can be more efficient you can get more done. You can save time, which essentially saves money as well. So hit me up in the comments. Let me know if that's something 
you think you'd be interested in um, or, or, or whatnot. And we can start talking more about that on the channel for sure. But I do want to start talking about some more advanced topics because I think, you know, the basics about Kindle publishing, it's all over the place. It's all there. It's really not going to change over the next little bit. Um, but some of the more advanced topics, the, the actual marketing stuff, those are the things that a lot of people, at least outside of the private Facebook group that the Blueprint has, is not talked about. So I want, I'd like to see some discussion on that for sure. So let me know what you think, uh, what you think about that. Um, what else has been going on with, 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 uh, with the business? I opened up my six week boot camp. link in the description below. Um, so that's um, it's publishing related. If you're, if you're looking just you want to work with me, for six weeks and help me scale your your publishing business, get it to the next le next level. I got a six week boot camp. It's in the description. You can check that out. You can apply. We'll have a we'll have a quick um, call. I'll assess how you're doing, see if it's a good fit, and then if it is, boom, we move forward. But uh, so that's an opportunity that people do have now as well. And um, goals and visions. This is something I'm going to talk about as well. Um, you know, I was going to talk. I was telling Mariana the other day, "Hey, let's let's really get our concrete goals and 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 plans over the next twelve to eighteen months sorry out." Because what we just decided, we're actually going to stay in Monterey for I don't want not forever. Thank good God Almighty. Um, but we're going to stay in Monterey for the next year or so. Um, the reason being is we are actually planning on moving over to. Um, to the Cancun area, well, Tulum, somewhere over in the south on the Caribbean side of Mexico. And when we go, we're, I'm hosting a mastermind there September 6th and the 9th in Cancun. Um, and we were going to stay a couple extra weeks so we could start scouting out um, apartments to rent or beach houses or things like that. And, but what we decided was um, it would be better to stay in Monterey and this is gonna sound so weird, and to get like I want to get an M5, a Ranger. We're, we're trying to figure out which one would. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I'm gonna drop the camera. <laughs> Need to get a camera. Uh, which one would be best for business? And um, she's like, Can, I don't know if we should really do both. Um, you know, move and live over there for the same time at the same time buying a new vehicle. And I was like, oh, wow, that makes sense. Maybe we don't. She's like, which one do you want to do more? I'm like, I want the car. We can go to the fucking beach wherever we want. <laughs> Get me the car. And so she's like, all right. So then we, we're going to stay in Monterey. And um, th that was one thing. We, we just we haven't really sorted out. I have my ideas. She has her ideas. But we're going to spend some more time talking about exactly where we want to see things move over the next 12 to 18 months. And I kind of have an idea where that I want the business to move. But I'd like to share that with all of you because I think that's kind of cool. Because then you can look back at these videos, much like what I've done with my older ones. You can look back at them and it's like, whoa, Mecca on June, what is it, the 24th, 5th, 6th or something like that. Today, you were talking about that. And now you got, you know, now you got the M5 or whatever the case is. So... I think that's kind of cool. It's also kind of powerful talking about what you want to get accomplished and then working out there and accomplishing it. Of course, that's one of the reasons I started these videos, right? Because the more I talk about it, the more I tell you about goals or ideas or plans that I have, the more re it becomes real. The minute I talk into this camera and upload it, it becomes real. So um, just making sure my mic's plugged in. I was like, oh, no, man, wasted eight minutes. But uh, so that's one of the things we're going to be doing, and uh, I'll talk more about that. It'll be a separate video on just our goals and our plans over the next 12 to 18 months because um, I think that'd be kind of neat to share with, with everyone. It's just kind of, you know, go along, take you along for the ride, so to speak. This this journey, when you're out building a, a laptop lifestyle, it can be lonely. I know I've spoken to a lot of you, and it can be lonely at times because you're, you're out, you're like, look what I'm doing. I'm holding a freaking camera because nobody's around. Right? I'm holding a camera. I'm talking into a camera. I, I work from my computer. It can be a lonely thing, right? Um, I don't have the luxury of being around a whole much. Right? Monterey. Monterey is not a very entrepreneurial city, right? It's just it's not like you know Vancouver or 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 uh, you know places throughout the U.S. or whatever the case is where there's a big hub. Um, it's just different. So um, 
you know, I think it's important that you, you share your goals and you, you connect with the people that are going to be viewing this. So you can kind of come along for the ride with me and, and come along with the journey. Um, but it's, it's, you know, it's cool. It's cool. So let's shift gears, talk about uh, the next thing. Um, coming up this week, I got um, just some cool other ideas and projects. I recently, actually this morning, signed up for Lewis Howe's Inner Circle. Um, my mentor was telling me, he's like, you got to go check this out. Sign up for it. It's 50 bucks a month. Uh, I, I don't even know what I get for it yet. I think I get a, a video, a, like a webinar a month. And I I really don't even know. I haven't had a chance to take a look at it. But I signed up for it because I wanted to see how he runs his monthly monthly programs as well. This is one, one of the other things, right? Always look in at some of the best people in the industry. Look how they do things. Copy, model, mimic them. Um, because, you know, Lewis Howe is somebody crushing it, doing millions of dollars every year. I want to see, you know, what he's doing so I can learn from him and, and improve my business as well. So always learning, always improving. Um, but other than that, um, yeah, I'm just looking forward. I got some great, great content coming out here. And here's a note. How many days a week do you want to see Kindle stuff? Two days a week, three days a week, more than that, um, I want to get more of a structure to the channel. Um, just as I'm becoming more efficient and more protective of my time, I can't deal with people wasting it anymore. Uh, that's just, uh, I got two kids now. Shit's on and popping. <laughs> can't have people wasting my time. So um, I'm really going to be more protective of my time, valuing it a lot more. Um, so that one of the things means getting, getting way more organized with how I do videos and stuff like that. So, um, video ideas, hit me up in the comments. I got a boatload of them that I need to be f filming over the next two weeks that I'll be doing and then posting those over, over, uh, the next, uh, ne next several weeks. But, um, yeah, cool. Other than that, everybody, great talking to you this Monday. Hope you all started your week on a awesome, awesome note. And, uh, let's just go crush it this week and make those dreams come true. Till next time, everybody. I'm Mecca. Speak to y'all soon.